Hey everybody. So I finally wrote down got prey. Sarah's playing as the female, I'm gonna play as the dude. As the lady, and I'm gonna play as the dude. I abide. Ah, the load times are pretty saucy. Let me go ahead and do my quick disclaimer, I guess. If you're watching this video, please give me a thumbs up. You know, uh, follow me on YouTube. Uh, follow us on Twitch uh, at JV McMaster. Follow us on Twitter at McMaster. Go visit Unwinnable in quarter to three. And let's get on with the game. Good morning, Morgan. Up, Today dude? is Monday, March 15th, 2032. In the land down under. And so we're running this on a GTX uh, 1080. Everything turned up, Max. Um. Hey, Morgan. Wake up. You're burning daylight. I sent the helicopter to pick you up. It's just a few tests. Don't forget to wear your suit. See you soon. Oh. Uh. Listen, I uh, Really great you decided to come on board. We're gonna shake things up, Morgan. Like old times. Oh, good. I'd hate to think we weren't gonna shake anything up. We shake this whole damn house up. Got sweet water up in there. Let's just double check our graphics options actually. Yep. Well, that is about what they offer us when we got it all the way. Okay. It's like food science. Yep. Cool. First day on the job. Those of us who are fans of Half-Life will always remember nothing bad happens on your first day of the job once you've put on a special jumpsuit. I like it a fish. Well, let's see what's up with this dude. Morning, Mr. Yu. Oh, lady. Hey, what's up? Heard there's a chopper on the roof. Must yeah. be for you. Probably chopping. Mr. Yu, please make yourself comfortable and we'll be on our way. Our Transtorm facility is just a short hop. 78 degrees, clear skies all the way. It's an Arcane Studios joint. That's a nice view on the bay there. Well, I got legs.
this is not going to look as great as it could, because seriously, I mean, it's kind of like, it's just a, uh, uh, Here we are, Mr. Yu. Small usage. Mind the glass on the way out. Um, Good luck to you. Hello, Dr. Yu. I'm a Sybil 495 science class operator. Welcome, uh -huh. Megan Yu. You have a 9 a.m. appointment in the testing facility. Please confirm. Our research often requires intense focus and long hours. <laughs> Morgan! Finally! Hey, what's up, buddy? hey, Alex, how you doing? Hey! Oh! Jesus. You don't look terrible in a trans star uniform. How's your eye? Still red? I know the test might seem a little unconventional, but it's a new family tradition. Breaking convention is in our blood. That's true. Once you start the test, just do whatever comes natural. Don't overthink it. Dr. Bellamy's gonna walk you through the process. You're in good hands. This guy. We'll be in orbit next week. I promise. Mr. Yu, they're ready for your brother in room A. Right. Go on. Listen. Just be yourself. I'll see you after. Okay. Dr. Bellamy. Looks like we have some tests to run through today. Probably not the kind of thing you're used to, I imagine, but trust me, you're going to do fantastic. All, right. All good? Great. Let's begin. For this first test, I'd like you to remove the boxes from the red circle as quickly as you can. Just go with your gut. Okay? Wonderful. Press the red button when you're ready. All right, I'm good at that. <laughs> You're absolutely fine. Uh, let's move on to room B, then. Okay. Okay, Morgan. Listen carefully. I'd like you to do your best to hide in this room. Take your time. Relax. Think it over. No, I'm kidding. You only have nine seconds. Hit the red button when you're ready to start. Glass was very good. Hmm, what? Any synaptic register at all? Mm, I was going bash. No? That's fine. Come here. Sorry, let's keep things moving, Morgan. No. Head into room C. You're doing marvelous. I don't feel like I'm doing marvelous with the way you guys are treating me. Alright. Here we go. For this test, please press the blue button across the room as quickly as you can in the most natural, intuitive way possible. Without thinking. Just, just go for it. Press the red button when you're ready. I'm sorry, can someone please explain to me what's happening? Someone? I installed exactly what Tina brought down. Did you double check? The speaker's still on. I apologize, Morgan. We're having some trouble with the equipment. Not your fault. You've been through with this, actually. Oh, well, that's One good. last room. Let's step into D. Shall we? Well, I want to step into D, guys. Come on, let me step into D. Alright. Can someone get me a cup of coffee? I would appreciate it. Who wouldn't? Though? Thank you. Okay, Morgan. 
Have a seat at the table for me, please. Wonderful job. Take a look at the screen in front of you. I'm going to show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Press start on the screen when you're ready. Alright, I'm getting a soda, so it's just going to have to wait. Doctor and patient pans. Whenever you're ready, Morgan. Whoa, I heard something squealing in the feeling. switch the track, so... Duh. Good. Next. Almost done. Wow. I'm impressed. Well done. Well done. We nearly threw it. For this next part, I'm going to display an image. I want you to take a good look at it. It looks like... In a moment, I'm going to ask you what... Looks like Hellboy. Um... Uh, is my coffee? It's empty. Oh! Oh! oh. oh my God. That's a... Security! Security! Unusual. Unusual Alex. behavior from a coffee Silence. mug. What's going on? We have a problem. What about Morgan? He's alive. Sedated. Clean it up. I'm on my way. Got it. it looks like we're gonna Good have morning, some Morgan. interesting Today stuff. is Monday, March 15th, 2032. Groundhog's Wait, so that's why 
house, I guess. Yeah, that's where I was. Yeah. And sometimes we need to be ready. Mm. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty worried about Dr. Bellamy. Bill Bellamy. Dr. Bill. <laughs> Absolutely silent, some simulation progress, and I understand it's only this. Uh, okay. Making this entire excuse defective. Oh, you can pick stuff up if you have. If you have stuff. Which I don't. Uh. What does it say? Uh, I I cop. Put it in there. Man. Oh, oops. Sorry. Sorry, computer. Of course. Oh, you know what? I didn't look at. What's over here? What's over here? What is this? Okay, that's funny. Hmm. So not cool. Okay. What's this? Watch out for coffee cups, it turns out. You don't want to have, uh, you know, like a Soviet Russia coffee cup, you know. And Soviet Russia coffee cup drinks you. We got here. I uh, can't make it out, whatever. And this is all. Yeah, and then. But this guy doesn't have the safe code written down somewhere. Ah, well, 
whatever. Let's move on. Let's move on. Okay, so. Here's our hallway. What do we got back here? A little bit of booze cruise. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Say something. Ah! Ah, you son of a bitch! Death! Okay, well, that was, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Pretty 
thorough, you know. Yeah, I don't buy that. I don't buy that at all. That's not a good looking face. It's a real bad time, in fact. Wait. That's not normal. That's what I thought. I would love to help, but, uh, no, can't. Yeah, why don't you turn into, like, a monkey face or something? No one has been able to stop the Mimics from multiplying since they broke containment. Mm. I'm going to help you stay alive. Just a little further. Vanishes, that's <laughs> all right. Experiment with different approaches ever from challenges with enemies. You can get past the lot door by searching for the key card or finding an alternative path. Okay, so this is uh, the, the Deus Ex. Let's see? Yeah, 
I know there's another one. Let's play piano. It's considerably more convincing when you don't see them. something to do with air ducts. Yeah, check that out. Uh, anyway. I'm like... Spoop. That was a phantom. Asmus. It sounds Keep bad. <laughs> okay, yeah, can do. What's this? It seems like a repair would be something you'd want to get, you know, pretty early on, I, I would guess. I would think, at least. Uh... Blue cannon disables or mobilizes. Okay, cool, cool. So, uh, it's like fire foam. Take as much of that stuff as we can. Uh, I mean, there's just part of me that wants to just like. Gotta 
rest up, old trooper. hear a spooky noise which as we all know are the worst kind of noises and I uh, is there a, is there a, like a, a, a there it is okay it's just not the thing button anyone in the entire world would use it I'm sneaking of course in the foyer. Grab the neuromod you see in the display case. Normally it's a fake, but I swapped in a real one for you. Okay. The neuromods are critical. You won't survive without using them to install new aptitudes. Yeah, I've already updated your transcribe with the list you requested. <clears throat> Take a look. Shit is about to get real. Where are you? Somebody turned into a... Yeah, a oh, crap. Oh, I wasn't looking. Alright, what do we got in here? Where is it? Get out of that one. Off mic, they're good. So. What hell is this? Ow! I mean, it's like by by a shock system, shock, shickety shock. So our options are hacking, physician. Let's 
see I'm drinking from these well, I turn them on. Clubs going up like a little like a point at a time. First toilet or sink thing. So anyway. If you're wondering why I'm being so stupid about that, that's why. Uh come here. That's right. That's what I thought. Dragging himself in here. See, we're at the uh, 91 now. Can I get out? That's that's the good question. There we go. Okay, so we've got hacking. Is there anything? that we could have hacked Zord. You sneaky snake. You sneaky little dab. Not really effective at combat. Really good at scaring the hell out of people, but not great at combat. Favorites will. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I gotcha, buddy. Let's do it. His contact name, January, is pulling us through the night. January. No, we gotta press any key here, but... Huh, well... You made it! Ready for your first real view of the world? No... Uh, what's this? Robert! Alice! Thank 
God, no one else is... Where are you? Hiding. I'm in the conference room. No one room. else is I hiding. Can't... Jesus, you're still in the lab? I can't I get can't, out. Jesus. There's... Where the hell is security? Well, I can't, Jesus I don't know what's either. happening, but Robert, you have to get out of there. Come to the elevators. Someone said we're evacuating. Robert? In our pants. Hang we're evacuating on. in our pants. Is Someone's what they coming. Said. It's Santa Claus. Huh. Good morning, Talos. As a reminder, all personnel must complete monthly physicals during their stay aboard Talos 1. Dr. DeVries promises to make them as quick and painless as possible. Hmm. Well, okay. That's the moon, huh? Alright, here's Earth. I'm gonna get scurvy. Attention, station leadership has issued an alert. All personnel should report to muster stations immediately and await further instructions. Excitement. 
That's the kind of things that jerks would do, though, man. Disguise yourself as a med kit and hurt somebody? That is so not cool. So not cool. What I want... Yummy noise. Fire, walk with me. Huh? Why well, is there a spooky sound? packing material gun and a pipe wrench. I'm ready for combat. Twenty thirty.
suck. Those mimics. something here oh sure I, I guess I could do that Fix that one. Not yet. Alright, what's all this? Hmm, some tomato jerky. Some pills, you know how I like those. And, um, Good morning, Talos. Oh. Warning. Tampering with administrative controls on workstations or keypads may result in electric shock. If you're having trouble accessing a system, please send a help alert to security. Whoa. Those things are, uh, yeah. and
suit needs to be repaired. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead 
can save up real quick. And we will see you. Yes. We will see you in part two.